Good afternoon, this is Alex from Camper Heat Company. Welcome again in this beautiful sunny winter day. Today I would like to show you our new cabin which we called Flex Plural. This is cabin which is uh, our basic model. We've changed our cabin specification this year so now we have available three models first basic model it's a flex plotter second middle one it's a deluxe and the fully loaded is still Sahara eyes but today flex plotter uh, this cabin we designed for people who um, like to travel uh, with less weight that cabin is much lighter than our two other models uh, yesterday i was on the weight bridge it was only 419 kilograms uh, so deluxe at the moment is 580 and sahara is, is 600 kilograms so nearly 200 kilogram less than sahara ice model but also this um, model has uh, different specification so i will switch the camera now and i will show you the cabin from inside uh, before i do that uh, i will tell you that cabin is much more spacious uh, here's much more room for sleeping and that cabin is much easier for configuration according to um, our customers needs okay i will change the camera now right so that is our cabin uh, from the back through the wall left front and right stop on the steps this is how it looks from the back So what is this cabin, what's the specification of this cabin? Let's start from the kitchen. So one cupboard above the kitchen, planner steering on the left, one light above the kitchen worktop, cold water sink. Uh, this cabin has two lights, one light above the kitchen and one double function light, daylight and night light above the seating area. So kitchen worktop and under the kitchen worktop two storage cupboards, quite, sp quite spacious, seven liters grey water tank, heating pipe and diesel pipe and at the bottom 13 liter diesel tank what's on the left so we really repl replaced um, roof lockers uh, upper lockers with mesh mesh nets on both sides you can see it here so the only solid upper lockers above the kitchen worktop just for some dishes heavier things i don't know i don't know the volume i don't remember the volume but uh, you can really put a lot of equipment in this uh, mesh nets so this window is, is 800 times 450 memes uh you can see still on the left uh, a plug it's a 12 volt plug in here and water level sensor 
and on the right WSB plug and battery uh, sensor so in the middle a mattress 160 times 200 it's a foldable also the whole bed is foldable so it's just you to, op to open you just need to drag it open the flap open the mattress and you have a big big bed so that's the same with uh with the table it's, you just need to slide it out when you you can use the table just in this this way you just slide it and you can also remove it and take it out and put it across the seating section on this aluminium angles one in here and one in here making extra bed at hall wide so you can see here also uh, uh, extra storage here under this shelf there's a battery and on the left it's an electricity compartment but you will see it on the pictures what's next uh, here you can see that seating section has two levels of cushions 10 centimeters each why because we offer in this cabin also a portable floor which is very easy to fix and very easy to dismantle remove so uh, when you have when you use this floor uh, you need to use double cushions which are included in price because it's much more comfortable for using the table and operating in this area when you don't use this removable floor you can see the storage it's here so on the other side it's the same I will not remove it it now I don't have too much time at the moment I just wanted to show you quickly the cabin because <clears throat> in the evening it goes to our customer in Germany uh, well yeah if you don't uh, use this uh, floor uh, you can just leave one cushions level and it's still the same it's very comfortable to use so uh, the interesting thing a new idea uh, in this cabin is um, that corner a big platform uh, you can see airline inside it's 70 centimeters long and on outside it's also 70 centimeters for fixing some extra uh, equipment extra stuff uh, but inside a big platform you can our idea is to use it for three uh, purposes first as a uh, dog's sleeping bed uh, second it's uh, you can use it as uh, for portable kitchen to keep it here and take it outside when the weather is nice and cook outside and third idea to use it as a st extra storage so you can put in here uh, you can put on it uh, aluminium shells with euro boxes and bolt them to this airline so under this platform you can see big storage for porta potty even big porta potty and also there's enough room for biotoy composting toilet and a small locker for some chemical stuff some toilet cleaners all right now the last storage uh, I don't know what for that you can put in here whatever you want <laughs> but I'm pretty sure you can find the idea how to use it right uh, this is what's inside and the vent is smaller than uh, our deluxe and saharais vents 
So it's a window 40 times 40 centimeters with with electrical vent. Right, I've switched on the lights now and we can go outside for a moment. Wow, what are differences when you look at the cabin from outside? So the cabin color it can be still gray or white. Uh, it can be made in structure. I don't know if you see anything here, but I think I hope you can see that. That's the cabin with structure, but it can also be polished with black strap uh, around the cabin. So uh, I forgot to say about the water inside. So inside there's uh, 47 liters fresh water tank and seven liters gray water tank. The battery is 100 amps AGM battery and battery charger 18 amps. So outside you can see solar wires on the roof. These wires are include, included in price, but not the solar panel, but it's available in our offer. So what are, what are the differences, uh, next differences when you look at the cabin from outside? So I said already about um, the structure, but you don't, you cannot have a Fiamma awning. Instead of Fiamma awning, we are just fixing awning rail and you can fix you can hook here uh, a light awning uh, one window outside no lights at the back but i'm pretty sure you already noticed a 13 pin plug which is for loading the battery board battery during driving uh, the battery is loaded with 10 amps so here is the planner auto term actually now compartment diesel heater uh, water water inlet the fixing point at the front in the front is also different uh, when you compare it to Deluxe and Sahara Ice, it's under the Alcops bed here. So in Sahara Ice, it's here, and in Deluxe, it's also at the same place. Why? Why did it make? Did we make it this way? So here is you. You don't have a service hatch at the bottom in this model. So this is why we had to remove it and fix it in this position uh, but personally I have to say it's much easier and much quicker to use and it's also 100% safe so at the back fixing points are the same so let's come back to the bottom so auto turn diesel air inlet and diesel exhaust and grey water outlet uh, no real lights at the back uh, on the left CEE plug electricity 230 volts and diesel inlet let's go on the other side the airline rail which I told you told you already 70 centimeters one window And I think that's it. This is our second unit. Uh, first one was tested actually from September last year. We can say it was a kind of prototype, but we didn't change. Uh, 
too much from that time, but the first unit was tested, checked. Uh, just small things were changed. But now that cabin is made, as you can see, you can see the six units and we have a few more units in our buildings. So ready to finish. Yeah. Okay, I hope you liked our cabin. Uh, I hope uh, many of you will be interested uh, just because of the weight, uh, the quality of our job. And uh, so what, what, what can I say? Uh, you are all invited, you are invited to send emails, make a phone calls asking about our products. Uh, I would like to wish you all the best, a lot of health in this not nice times. Hopefully in the summertime or at least let's hope or, or in uh, springtime uh, earlier uh, the situation will, will be much better and uh, I believe we can start planning our holidays with cabins wherever you go. Uh, and I think all the ba all bad things gone. Uh, so thank you very much. Uh, once again, all the best, and I hope uh, we'll stay in touch. Bye.